Hello and welcome back to the channel and today you join me for this week's Falls Fun Guide called Science Meets Speed which wants you to own and drive the 2013 Aerial Atom V8 500 so without further ado let's get stuck into it. Now this is the car in question, the 2013 Aerial Atom 500 V8, it will set you back 200,000 credits from the auto show or you can probably pick one up a little bit cheaper in the auction house. Another thing to note is I've left this car bone stock, I have not created a tune for it. Now the first challenge here simply wants you to earn 6 stars at speed traps, so there's obviously quite a lot that you can pick from, but the one I went for is the Paso Inferior. Now 3 stars on here is only 105 mile an hour and 2 stars is only 80 mile an hour, so it's one of the easiest speed traps to complete. Now I know what you're thinking, this is a lightweight rear engine sort of rear wheel drive car. Uh, so it might struggle on the dirt roads but as you can see here it's not too difficult so i got three stars on two runs and two stars on that second that return run there but all in all it only took me about 35 40 seconds to complete uh, so it's a nice easy challenge there now the next one here simply wants you to take a photo of the aerial atom so obviously all you want to do is hit up on the d-pad to bring up the camera and then just hit the right bumper to take a horizon promo quick shot come out of that and it will show up as challenge complete for the final challenge here, it literally wants you to win a road race. So to do this, I headed over to the Arch of Mule circuit, which I found out is actually called the Arch of Mule Hay. But anyway, um, I've created a race here called Forzathon Easy. The share codes are on your screen there. So it's literally one lap with no AI driver tasks. You're guaranteed a win. It will literally take you about a minute to complete. So it's super easy. And of course, with there being no AI driver tasks, you don't have to worry about anyone else on the track. So you're always going to be guaranteed a win. But you only have to do it once for this challenge. So nice and simple there. And that is this week's Forzathon complete. Now, hopefully this guide did help you out if you needed it. Um, if it did and you're new to the channel, I'd very much appreciate if you could subscribe. And of course, dropping a like massively helps me out. And if you're struggling with anything, then please do let me know down below in the comments. I'm more than happy to help you guys out. But apart from that, folks, I want to thank you very much for watching. I want to wish you all the best. Make sure you stay safe and take care.